so let's go here so in the store we are receiving um, we are uh, saving this like this right so here we need to also customize this uh, booking so here you are returning this uh, booking and uh, you need to add a color property when you are adding this booking so let's go here and let me add this here cut this out from there and uh, here the first one would be the id okay and uh, let me go there and uh, change this to booking and booking id okay and wow why i put this semicolon so let me copy and paste okay and then you need to add this uh, start okay it's a start and this would be a uh, and oops why it's not typing so and okay and then this would be the title okay and make this start date because we are receiving this from the database right start date would be the uh, added this to start and ended this added to this and date and this title would be added to this title okay and uh, then the color okay so we want to add a color here right so color so let me add a color variable here so it would be a color equal null okay and then here i need to check that uh, if the booking title equal equal test then the color would be the now let me grab the color okay this one right so color is this one and uh, yes we are uh, implementing this color and if the color is uh, if the title is test then this color will be applied okay so let me make this ternary operator why i'm adding this ternary operator because if the user uh, select the title another one from this uh, test uh, like uh, user put test one so it will uh, uh, throw the undefined variable right so i'm catching this if uh, it's not returned the color it will return an empty right so this one would be the color return the color and if not return an empty right so this is a short if else okay so you can see that it's a ternary operator so go here and now let's go to the index blade and go to the success function and here we are receiving these response right response so ended and stuff like that so here we need to also add a color property okay so this would be the response dot color so save this one give it a refresh and check that is it still working or not okay go here and go to the 23 and create an event in the 23 so click on this save changes and yes it's added but uh, it's throwing the error it's throwing has time error so weird stuff why we are receiving this error so I uh, found the problem that uh, why it's throwing this error because uh, we are passing the start and end here and I'm uh, getting this start and uh, start date and end here so I need to remove this uh, date uh, suffix okay save this one give it a refresh and now I'm closing this terminal because I hope it's going to work right click on this 26 make this test 26 26 take i and yes it's working like a charm watch the another videos so i will meet you in the next